Okay, so this is Explore, and uh, for this one, we are working with green hues. We do a base. Uh, we use green. Green is one of the least uh, common bases that I use, but for Explore, we do that. Uh, then we just make it dark over the bottom half anyway, so the green really doesn't show through at all. Then on the top, we do a lighter green, and as we get towards the top, we're blending yellow and very, very light yellow into yellowish green colors into the more bold greens on the bottom. And the top third of this card is really where 90% of the work is. And uh, it's just blending the colors in. As you can see, we're putting on the paint and it's very wet. We're waiting for it to dry. <coughs> I decided to um, emphasize and make the dark third of the card a little more exciting. And I put like some splash uh, green in with the brush. Uh, and then after that dry, we went back to the top and we put in some more um, colors that were lighter and into the yellow and then as you're seeing right now we went back to the bottom and we're going back to the top again it's just kind of back and forth waiting for the paint to dry and uh, there are clips I should note in here uh, there's different time stamps um, there's a lot of time that you're not seeing where this is really drying uh, this is really more like three or four videos put together um, because obviously you have to wait for paint to dry before applying new paint unless you're going for an unusual effect of mixing paint once it's on the card but uh, then when it's done, you use a toothpick to fine tooth, uh, to fine line the edges and the lines, make sure they're detailed, and this is the end result. This is just one of the ways that you can do explore, uh, and it's a very nice card if you like different shades of green and yellow, because uh, that's really what it is. Uh, so that's it. Let's explore, and hopefully we'll see you at the next one.